Hi, it's Paul from wave5trade.com. This is today's example setup for a potential long from our wave 5 trade signal service. Um, there's a lot of long trades setting up after the last two days bear moves, so uh, quite a few to choose from. So let's have a look at the spreadsheet. So our members get these everyday downloadable spreadsheets on the weekly, the daily and the 60 minute. I've gone for the 60 minute today after a couple of days pullback. There's quite a few setting up here as you can see, quite a lot of signals here. So I've gone for AIG just here, American International Group. So let's have a look at the chart. Okay, so this is the chart for AIG on the 60 minute time frame. This is using our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the NinjaTrader NT8 platform. First of all, we can see that the 535 moving average here at the bottom has pulled back between 90 and 140%. And that's one of our criteria for those filters on the scanners. That's a really good tick in the box. We've got the stochastic crossover in the oversold zone, another part of the filters on the scanner. And finally, the wave four of the Elliott wave sequence has pulled back into the pullback zones. The red zone is a 75% probability it's going to go on and make a new wave five high into this blue zone here, which is our automated target zone, around about 65, 70, something like that. To isolate this, for those of the members that are watching this video, on this 60 minute chart we've got a big range bound period here over quite a number of days, seven, eight, nine days, and then we start to move higher. So this is where to isolate the bar count because this is the trend, that's just sideways movement. We get the ABC, little AB correction there, the one, two, the big three, the wave four pullback, now it's found support, we're looking for the long. So how have I set this up? Quite simply, we use our 6-4 moving average high and lows. So the 6-4 moving average high, the green moving average high here, is for a conservative entry. And so what I've done is looked at the, the first bar position for today's session, for the 31st of January. And uh, we'll be breaking through there on the first or second bar on the 6.4 moving average high, also above the whole $64 mark. So conservative entry long on AIG for the 60 minute chart at 64.08. And as you can see there with the stop loss just below the wave four there, the low is 63.11, so you need to be around about 63.06, something like that for the stop loss. And you see the risk to reward there is one to 1.6 into our target zone. So a great risk to reward for this potential long on AIG using the scanner signals from wave5trade.com. Thank you and I'll speak to you all tomorrow.